Hey YouTubers, Farm Boy Reef here. So on today's episode, um, we're going to do an update on how Landon's 20 gallon tank's doing with his uh, two clowns and Rose Bubble Tip and Enemy. Um, from my previous videos, I was showing you guys how to train the two uh, tank race clowns that have never been in contact with an enemy before. So by using the Betty Crocker strainer uh, technique, it worked really well, so I'm having great success. So I wanted to, what I want to do today is bring you guys up close and personal to show you how things are going. Um, I got the anemone in there and I got his two clowns and everyone's getting along really well. So I wanted to do a little update, show you guys the whole process, uh, how things are going. Alright guys? Okay, so I released the two uh, clowns into the tank. They're looking really nice on black with all the purple uh, coralline algae that's growing. It's been taken off really well. This LED grows this out really well. I like that. So the next part is I got to get get the anemone out and get him into the tank and I'm hoping he'll go onto that piece of live rock there that's got the holes in it. His feet will latch into that. So that's that's going to be the next part, guys. All right, guys. So I got my rose bubble tip off. So right now I just got a bag. I didn't want to get stung. So what I'm doing is I'm just holding the anemone where I want him. So I'm hoping this will work and he'll just stay here and be happy. So you can see him right there. He's closed up a bit, but I'm hoping by just holding him, his foot will attach in one of the crevices on the rock. So that's what I'm trying to do right now. All right guys, so it's 5.26 in the morning. I just turned the lights onto the tank and there we go, posting. That's perfect, just what I wanted. So Lance should be happy when he wakes up this morning seeing his clowns hosting. The other one must be really hidden in there. And I got your anemone in there with your fish. You want to go see it? Yeah. Let's go see. Where are they? Holy, what's that? Anemone. You're an anemone? Yeah, the bone. Yeah. Can you get up there and check them out? It's looking really cool. Hey, look at that. Hi, the snails. I know, it's nice. Hey, the snails. Oh. You feed them. Hi, look the at them. Hi, the snails. Look at your rose bubble tip, Landon. Well, I did you smell down. Did you? Yep. Look at them. Are they cool? Yeah. You like that? <laughs> so now we just got to get your LED lights up, eh, son? Yeah. Your new Radeon from Phil? Nice. Hey guys, so we're up and close and personal with the rose bubble tip and the clowns. So they're hosting up really nice there right now. They're a little hungry, it looks like. So I got some food, I got some shrimp. So I'm just gonna dump some in here and some refroids and try to feed this anemone and the fish at the same time. So you can latch onto it. So they're eating up the shrimp. So something what they'll do is they like to take it back to the anemone and they feed their host. So you can see the anemone, he's got his uh, shrimp that he's picking up. So everybody's really happy, everybody's doing really well. Alright guys, so that was another uh, little uh, successful uh, mini-series. So we got the tank race clowns to host the, the rose bubble tip, no problem. So he's going to be a nice showpiece in that tank. He's right in the middle of the overflow box. I can't ask for anything better than that. And everybody's really healthy. So I just uh, hope you guys like this episode. So Landon's tank is uh, coming along really well. Um, so we're going to move on to more of the tank build and uh, see what other uh, creatures and corals we can get in there. So the next thing we'll be going on is uh, we're going to add the... The Radeon over top of the tank from Phil from Under the Tide. Thanks a lot, buddy. It's soon going to be going up. Just got to get the, the hangers for it. So thanks for watching, guys. Please subscribe and uh, hit the like button. You never know what video is coming up again next, guys. Thanks. Bye.